Hello everyone, today we're going to talk about how to make your files copy and move faster in Windows. If you've ever waited a long time for your files to transfer, this video is for you. We'll show you some easy ways to speed things up. These tips will help whether you're copying files to a USB drive or moving them between folders on your computer. Before we start, if you want to learn more about making your computer faster and easier to use, please subscribe to our channel and like this video. It really helps us create more content like this for you. Now, let's get started with our first tip to make your file transfers faster. We're going to change a setting in Windows that many people don't know about. First, open your Start menu and type Services. Click on the Services app when it appears. Now, look for a service called Optimize Drives. You might need to scroll down to find it. When you see it, double-click on it. A new window will open. In this window, look for Startup Type and change it to Automatic if it's not already set to that. This tells Windows to always keep your drives working at their best. Don't forget to click Apply and then OK to save your changes. Now let's turn this service on right away. If it's not running, click Start. If it is running, click Restart. This small change can really help speed up your file transfers. Our second trick involves turning off something in Windows that can actually slow down your file transfers. Go back to your Start menu and this time search for Turn Windows Features On or Off. Click on it when it appears. You'll see a list of many features. We're looking for one called Remote Differential Compression API Support. When you find it, uncheck the box next to it. This feature is meant to help with transferring files over the internet, but it can slow down transfers on your own computer. By turning it off, we're telling Windows to focus on making local file transfers faster. Click OK and Windows might need to restart. That's OK, it's worth it for faster file transfers. For our last tip, we need to use a special command that can really help speed things up, especially if you have an SSD in your computer. We need to open something called the command prompt as an administrator. To do this, right click on the start button and look for Windows Terminal admin or command prompt admin click on whichever one you see now carefully type in this command after you type it press enter this command helps your computer manage files better which can make your transfers faster that's it we've just made three important changes to speed up your file transfers in windows Let's quickly go over what we did. We changed a setting to optimize your drives all the time, we turned off a feature that was slowing things down, and we used a special command to help your computer handle files better. All of these changes work together to make your file transfers faster. Remember, the exact speed increase you'll see can be different depending on your computer, but you should notice that things move a bit quicker now when you're copying or moving files. Thank you for watching this quick guide. If you found it helpful, please don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more helpful tips about computers. Have you tried these methods? Let us know in the comments if they help speed up your file transfers. Thanks again, and see you in the next video.